Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Aaron Hilliard. Thank you for joining Mushroom Wonderland. This is a little bit different of our usual videos because normally I'm in the woods helping identify mushrooms, but a big part of mycology is actually microscopy. Today I just got a package that showed up on my doorstep and I'm pretty excited because this is a new microscope. This is a great microscope to learn to start with. I ordered this off Amazon. It is a uh, research grade microscope, a compound microscope. So this is the Swift 380B. And today I'm gonna do a little unboxing thing and I'm gonna pull this all out and we'll have a look at it. And uh, we'll even look through the lens and see what how, how well it looks at some mushroom spores. And uh, just give you an idea, if you're t entertaining the idea of getting into microscopy, taking your interest to the next level, a microscope is the way to go. This was like $280 on my front door the very next day from Amazon. Comes with uh, warranty information and a little user guide. There we go. All right, we ready for the moment of truth? Ooh. So, it looks pretty nice. So right here, this is a bottle of immersion oil. And in one of the reviews, I heard to be careful that this lid, lid doesn't like to stay on this bottle. It only seems to be like halfway full, which is kind of weird. The high magnification lenses use oil immersion. I'm gonna set that to the side. And then a little blue lens. I'm not exactly sure what that's for. These are your eyepieces. And uh, they're wrapped pretty neatly in here. There we go, 10X. Here's one of the eyepieces. And here's the other one. Are your other eyepieces. There, you can switch them out. These ones are 25X eyepieces. Just a cover for when you're not using it. You can cover your microscope so dust doesn't get in there. This yes, the cord for the LED lights. Regular 110 cord. And now for the microscope. Plastic and rubber band. Get all that wrapping out of the way, and there she is. Look at that, the head swivels. It's got a dimmer so you can have it as bright or dark as you want. Right here you have the coarse and fine adjustment knobs for focusing, for getting your slide closer and farther from the objective. So right here is where we will put in our eyepieces. These are just protective dust caps. And we're going to put in our 10x eyepieces. Easy as that. This microscope did not come with any microscope slides or cover slips, so I had to buy these separately. But I'm gonna mount a slide with some mushroom spores so that we can just have a look through the eyepiece. I'm not really gonna get into a lesson about microscopy here today, but uh, I've got a clean slide here. I'm gonna just kinda set that down, and I have this foil where I've taken some spore prints. I'm just gonna scrape some of these spores up, 
tap them right in the center of this microscope slide. I'm going to add a drip of water. One small drip of water. And I'm going to put a cover slip on there. The cover slips have a tendency to stick together. You don't want to get your oil from your fingers all over it. Perfect. And now I'm going to just set this on the, uh, on the tray here. This little arm right here actually keeps it in place. Our knobs are down here on the side to go back and forth, right and left. Adjust the binoculars so that they fit my head. There we go. So there you go, the Swift 380B. So thank you all for joining Mushroom Wonderland and we will see you on the next episode. Much love everyone, peace out.